Welcome, I'm B. Today I'm gonna to be giving you the ultimate holiday gift guide. This does not mean Christmas, this does not mean Hanukkah, this means whatever you celebrate, whether it's a birthday, any gift you need right now. I know this is titled for your girlfriend, but really only because I thought that would do better with the searches, this does not have to be for a girl. My love language is gift giving, so I wanna go through and give you a list of 10 things that's gonna make your loved one feel very special. It doesn't have to be something super expensive, but you do want something thoughtful. First gift. A lit mirror. Lighting is everything in makeup. You can do your makeup, it can look absolutely perfect in the dark, and then you walk into natural lighting and it's like, so I'm gonna show you some features on this mirror here that make it the perfect gift for anyone doing their makeup. They are going to die over this. So what I really love about this vanity is, well, everything. Okay, one, like, it's so big, so beautiful. It makes the whole aesthetic of this look absolutely perfect. We have these big bulbs, and these actually come with the vanities, so all the prices included. And these by themselves are like five or ten dollars each, so that's actually a huge, huge thing that they come with it. We have my charger for my phone right here because there are two USB plugs along with two plugins, so you can do all the things you need to do. You have the on and off switch, so it's not running all the time. And you have a dimmer. And if you watch my channel, you know this is the mirror that I won. The quality is amazing. I was really surprised these are handmade, custom for you, and it's just perfect quality. I mean, I've, I've not seen a nicer one. Truly, truly, I have not seen a nicer one. This one here, they sell for $500. They do have a medium for $400. A small for, and I'm like doing this with my hands, this is not the size, okay? Uh, a small for 300 and a full body for 500 as well. And I'll link all their information below. I think they also are starting a payment plan too. You know you see your partner sitting on the floor doing their makeup or like trying to like get the right lighting. It's raining outside, they walk outside, they look like a clown, you look like a clown because you're walking with them. Nobody wants that. Second perfect gift idea an experience, something you can do together. This can be as cheap as an Airbnb night away cuddled up a hundred bucks or as expensive as going to like a vineyard somewhere in an Airbnb, going to like an amusement park, a Hawaii vacation. This can be as big or as small as you want it, um, but an experience away or even just an experience doing a class together. Something like a baking class, a cooking class, anything you're doing together that is an experience, a bungee jumping, I mean just any type of experience that you're like having together is gonna be a super fun time. Third on my list is gonna be a couple's massage. This is something a lot of people don't treat themselves to and if you're on your feet all day or sitting in a desk all day, you need a massage. So what better excuse to make it romantic, you know you're gonna feel all touchy and all oily and then just do whatever you wanna do after that. So that price is gonna be about 160 to um, 200, depending on where you go. Also remember to tip. Number four is also gonna be really romantic. This is a canvas called Love is Art. So what this is, is you choose the colors. You can choose like the canvas color, whether it's black or white. They have ideas on their website so you can get a view of like what looks good together. Also some creative ideas. I'm gonna put some here for you to check out. But this is about $70. So you put the paint all over your body and then you do what consenting adults do, on there. It's definitely a romantic night event. And then whenever you're done with it, you get it stretched and it's a piece of art. So you can hang it on your wall, above your bed, in your living room. Nobody knows what y'all did on there, just y'all too. But it is a really sweet, fun, like bonding activity and a piece of art you always have um, showing your love. The fifth idea is going to be something to support your partner's hobby. So if their hobby is doing YouTube videos. One year Josh got me like a new mic, um, a lighting situation, always things like that because he knows this is like what I invest in and what I care about. Other ideas would be if their hobby is doing makeup. You can go to Ulta, Sephora. I don't wanna give you suggestions here because I want you to be able to use this all year. Also, you know what your person has. You need to go look when they're not there, take pictures, bring that in. Because I have so many times where I'm in a store and people come in and they're like, oh, she likes palettes, she likes this, she likes that. The things I'm gonna suggest are probably things she already has if she's obsessed with makeup like you're making it seem she is. So go take pictures. Bring those pictures in so you can get the right makeup for her. They can give you suggestions based off of what she already has. So you're not doubling up. She doesn't have to return it. It looks like you're paying attention, okay? But anything that's going to go with her hobbies. You can get her a book. Like um, if you know she's trying to start a business, a business book. If she's wanting to learn to cook, you can get her some cooking classes. Whatever it is your partner loves doing, 
go in that direction. Now, if you're thinking, oh my gosh, like she is so good at keeping the house clean. She loves vacuuming. She's always talking about like different house chores. Housekeeping is not her hobby. She can be super mom. He can be super dad. They don't want housekeeping accessories. Don't buy that. That helps you. It helps them. It helps you together. It is not a gift for one person, okay? If for Valentine's Day, y'all talk and y'all decide we're going half skis on a new washer, that's one thing. Housekeeping is not a hobby, no matter how good they are at it, okay? If you cannot afford something like Grand Dose, like a trip somewhere, still, if you're just paying attention, you will find something that your partner wants, like as something as small as a lipstick, something as small as like a dart. Like, it does not matter. Look at what they actually like doing outside of the home, okay? Number six is going to be a gift for you both that you can buy for your spouse. This is gonna be a boudoir photo shoot. How fun. Okay, so you're gonna look up um, a boudoir photographer, look on Instagram, on Google, find somebody, look at their photos, sexy, good stuff. Make sure that you look at their work and make sure they're not just some creepy man with a camera on the internet, okay? Most boudoir photographers are gonna offer dates where they have hair and makeup teams there. What is a better gift than getting your person glammed up, hair on, makeup on, going feeling sexy? She is going to feel so good about herself. And then you're gonna get the photos back. You're gonna have those photos to like look at your person and be like, dang, like this, this is me, I got this, you know? Um, and she's just gonna be able to look back at those and feel really good about herself. That is gonna be such a confidence booster. This is one that I just cannot like stress enough how good this is gonna be for your relationship. She's gonna feel so good about herself. She's gonna make you feel so good when you see these photos, when she sees these photos, she's gonna be feeling confident. It's gonna be a good time. Number seven, subscription box. Okay, everybody loves subscription boxes. Let me tell you why this is a great idea. It's every month. So for six months, you know, three months, maybe even a year, you're gonna have something arriving every month that's gonna remind your partner that you are thinking about them. They have some starting at about $20 for something like a coffee subscription, all the way to like $300 for like a clothing subscription. Anything you can think of, there's probably a subscription box for. We have sheet masks, wine, everything and i'm gonna list a few links for really fun and different price ranges ones in the description below so be sure to check there if that's what you're interested in number eight is gonna be personalized art these are gonna be personalized like kind of family photos like drawings and such so cute we have some examples here and here and here it can be you your partner y'all's animals maybe just your partner don't know actually don't do just your partner <laughs> somebody did that for me before that one was weird like not just them it makes it just <sighs> As much as I love myself, receiving a picture of myself drawn was, it's, you, where do you hang that? Like, don't, don't do it with just them. Make it like a little family photo, okay? It shows that you put a little bit of work in, thought beforehand, and had this done, so that's a really great idea as well. Number nine is gonna be an instant camera. You could get your spouse a camera and then take pictures of maybe something that reminds you of them and also present that with the camera. Like have it open and just a few pictures in there, maybe some selfies of you, maybe like, you know, just like little things that remind you of them and that would be really, really thoughtful and they would have that to look back on. So I really like the instant camera idea. And then last but not least, number 10, we're gonna have fun classes. So this is gonna be something that your spouse can go do on their own. This could be a little different than experience y'all have together. This is going to be some alone time. I think this would be great for um, a stay-at-home mom, just a mom in general, somebody who needs to have like a reason to get out of the house. This is your time once a week. You go away. You don't worry about anything. I got this, okay? So this is going to be something like um, a yoga class, a aerial yoga class, like a pole dancing class, something like that, that they go out and like release with. A dancing, just like any type of dancing class, that's gonna be really fun and just a reason for them to get away once a week. You can do this for like a month. These classes can range from $10 to like $20 each. Those are my 10 ideas for, I think, award-winning gifts that will help you earn all the extra bonus points in the gift-giving love language. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please check the description below so that you can have all the links and all my suggestions so you can just click, 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 bye, 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 easy peasy. Be sure to subscribe, hit the bell, check out some other videos. See you later.